everyone i hope you're doing well today i have another tag video for you this was originally done by demi rolling and her sister where they talk about different types of girls and the perfumes that they might wear some other youtubers have also done this and this is my version of the tag it's just a fun tag nothing super serious so please watch it in that spirit and i hope that you have fun watching it if you like this kind of content then please subscribe as I make videos on perfume, beauty products and handbags and I do hauls and reviews of these products. So please hit like and subscribe buttons and do not forget the bell icon so you're notified each time I upload new videos. So let's start. The first category of girl is the clubbing girl and for this category I will choose a fragrance that will last all night and my pick for that is Gucci Rush. Now this is a very bold and fun and long-lasting fragrance. At first you get the gardenia and the freesia and then it goes down to jasmine and the dry down there is a bit of sweet patchouli. It also has some bitter undertones probably from the coriander seeds or the bourbon notes. The bitterness makes it more sensual and more interesting of a fragrance. And this is what I personally used to wear when I used to go clubbing so that's why I picked this one. Next is the smart girl. For me, a smart girl is someone who is street smart, who is educated and who appreciate perfumes and is knowledgeable about them. I would imagine her to wear a perfume that is classic yet quite wearable today. And for that, my pick is Mitsuko. Now, this is a beautiful fruity chypre that keeps evolving all day long as you wear it. The fruity, floral and chypre notes play all day long and they take turns to come up and which is what I absolutely love about this fragrance and this is one of my all-time favorite fragrances. Third is the Sporty Girl. Now for this I think she will need something that will last and be very refreshing. So I will go with Aqua de Jua from Giorgio Armani. Now this is a very fresh, very sweet an aquatic fragrance and it's it just feels very cooling and refreshing. Number four is the shy girl. I'm thinking that type of girl who would want a fragrance that is beautiful but stays close to her. She doesn't want to make a statement and yet she wants to wear something that is really pretty and for that my pick is Rose Milano by Armani Privé. This is a really beautiful rose fragrance. It starts out a bit citrusy, but then it becomes a very soft green and powdery rose and creates this really soft cloud of floral whiffs that you get all day long and it stays quite close to the skin. So it's a really soft, delicate kind of a fragrance that I think a shy girl would like. The next category is elegant or classy girl. For that, I will have to go with Chanel No. 5 Eau Première. Now, this is a really warm, powdery floral. Although it's a step down from the classic number no. 5, it does have the number no. 5 DNA and it's really, really sweet and it's quite effortless. It's very elegant. You can wear it during the day or in the evening and you really can't go wrong with this. You can wear it to work for an evening out and just the kind of fragrance somebody who's very classy would like. Next is the Tomboy. Now for this category I went for fragrances that are a bit unisex. Those in my opinion are Jo Malone's Wood Sage and Sea Salt. And I actually have two in this category. So I have the Guerlain's Aqua Allegoria's Bergamont Calabria. Both these fragrances are quite different. Now this one is very salty, and woody and very aquatic and it's really really pretty and I I like it a lot. As you can tell I am almost out of it so I need to repurchase this one. And the other is Bergamot Calabria which is a recent addition to my collection and this is a beautiful citrusy, very green citrusy uh, fragrance and it smells really nice, very refreshing, very cooling again for summer months. And I think someone who's a tomboy will enjoy this fragrance. Next is the mom. Now for a mom, I would think that she would wear something that is very classy, something that is maybe slightly vintagey um, 
and something that's warm and spicy and for that my pick is youth dew this is a really beautiful fragrance it has vanilla in it which keeps it really sweet and that's something the kids always like and they're like mama you smell so nice and you smell so cozy and i think this captures what a mother would like to wear or a mom would wear i mean this is so beautiful i just love it number eight is girl about town now this one can take in two ways one is that this is a girl who's super busy she has a lot of errands to run and she's meeting up her friends for coffee then she has dinner with family or friends and you know just having a very busy day and in that sense my pick would be another one from chanel called gabrielle now this is the essence and this is a really beautiful fragrance and i again one of those fragrances that i don't see a lot of people talking about um, it's a beautiful floral mask and i like the essence better than the original gabrielle uh, this one I find to be a more rounded, more full bodied than the previous version of it. And it's really beautiful. And I generally don't like musk in my fragrances, but this is really nice. And again, this will go from day to night, summer, winter, any weather. And it's very, very modern and elegant fragrance. So that is one. And then the other take on girl about town is someone who's very playful someone who likes to date a lot and you know be that kind of you know in quotes that kind of girl about town so this one was a bit difficult for me to pick and after some thought i decided to go with la vie belle i would imagine her to wear a fragrance that would attract men that would last a long time and that would have a very amazing sillage. This is a very sweet fragrance. The fragrance is quite pleasing to men and I imagine this is what a girl about town would like to wear. Next category is the mean girl. Now I don't have a fragrance for this category because I don't think I have anything that a mean girl would want to wear in my collection. I don't know. I mean, sorry guys, I will pass on this one. Uh, number 10 is Boss Girl. And for that, uh, my pick is Coco Chanel. Now, this is an absolutely beautiful fragrance. It's really strong and it's for a very strong and bold woman, which you'd expect a boss lady to be. Now, this is a very warm, spicy, sweet and powdery floral fragrance it has a lot of flowers but the dry down is really amazing and it's a winter time fragrance for me at least that's what i like to wear in the winter it has vanilla it has honey it has musk it has patchouli and sandalwood and vetiver and all the good things and it's really really a powerful fragrance it's not your everyday every time kind of a fragrance and i personally like wearing this in the winter when I have important meetings, when I want to just seem a bit more authoritative, I will wear this. So I hope you like my pics and enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye.